Hello everyone! In this comparison video, I'll be comparing the stitching qualities of Fusion and Max, where there is a clear, a visible improvement from one to the other. Uh, there actually was something big that I was missing in the last comparisons about Max that I had no clue of since Max wasn't even officially out in the market yet. Having said that, I'll very briefly introduce you whereabouts Scope Pro Max has evolved from Fusion. So when there is a spherical video that needs to be converted to video files that we know, uh, the colors need to be projected to the video plane. But problem here, we end up having too much pixels on some parts while there are too little on the other parts. But GoPro Max has resolved this issue in a very interesting way and I'll be talking more about this in an engineering view in videos coming after this. Now let's see why the trick was so important in making Max better. Here I'm showing you the stitching line of each camera. And as you see, it's a lot clearer on Max side. I mean, I always thought stitching lines are supposed to be uh, blurry and searchy, but Max doesn't have it. By the way, this is where uh, the cameras are facing front, uh, which is far from stitching line. Now let's see how it's gonna have to look on a moving scene where I'm holding this camera walking around. Again, this is a stitching part of each camera. Uh, you can notice, you can find the waving sort of stitching distortion on the top of each. So yes, it's still there in Max, but if we look closer, uh, Max stands clearer on the borderline and has less stitching distortions. Now let's see how it's gonna turn out in a low light condition. Here's our stitching part, but it's sort of hard to see in the dark, so I marked it for you. And now if you look closer, uh, you can actually see the distortion happens a lot more on Fusion side than it does on Max side. And by the way, this is the part without uh, the stitching problem. So my verdict, it's the stitching is just better on Max. And it's not just the stitching that's better, but also those image quality uh, around stitching line. I mean, it's just amazing that GoPro has solved it. Uh, pixel density problem that I thought it's just it's just the way it is for 360 videos so this is it for the stitching comparison and I'll see you next time